10 minutes of non-stop news. Your hour-by-hour forecast. This is the News You Trust 10 at 10 in high definition. A family is celebrating a new family member tonight. The new life brought into the world today. Trevor Andrew Lee, while Trevor's mom and dad have been ready for his birth for a couple of weeks now, his entry was nothing like what they expected. Chase Moffitt joins us live to explain. A mom, Sarah Lee, is resting peacefully at Methodist Women's Hospital tonight. At her side, her husband, Chris. Baby Trevor is being monitored by doctors for a small infection. It was where the entire birth was supposed to play out. Baby Trevor had been. Went to the nurse practitioner yesterday. To say that life is what happens while plans are being made would be an understatement for the Lee family. Chris and Sarah have been expecting a boy. The pains of pregnancy, though, were taking its toll on mom. I've had a lot of excruciating back pain all week, and so went to the doctor thinking I was going to labor on Tuesday. A false alarm, but the doctor supplied more painkillers. The pain, now a normal feeling every morning, and again this morning, Sarah was sleepless. She was tired, and she tried to rest. Then... Okay, something's definitely going wrong, and I'm like, what is that? And yeah, it was his head trying to pop through, and within seconds, he was out. The baby was out by 8.55 a.m., born in Sarah's home. After calling 911, Sarah called her husband. He's like, is it time to go? I was like, yeah, a little bit more than time to go. He's actually already here. What? Yeah, 8 pounds, 2 ounces, 22 and a half inches long. By 9.09, mom and baby Trevor were on the way to the hospital. Dad following with the rest of the baby gear. A panic moment then. Turns out it's a great story amongst family now. We've been prepared. We just didn't know it was going to come like this. So I said we had a birth plan. We had the car seat in the car. We had my bag, my bobby ready to go. Just wasn't on the agenda to deliver at home. <laughs> and be over eight pounds. <laughs> family jokes, they'll now be on Trevor time. It'll be nice to see more of his personality come out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. And, and next spring out comes the baseballs. Cut my heavier chin a little bit. Maybe. I'm all right with that. He's got my eyes right now, Just but it'll probably change your eyes. He doesn't need to go tea yet. <laughs> <laughs> we'll give him till his teens. <laughs> The family does joke now, but baby Trevor was born healthy and just fine inside the home. Doctors say that small infection would have been there regardless of where he had been born. They are going to monitor baby Trevor just to make sure that infection doesn't spread to pneumonia. Family tells me they could be at the hospital anywhere from 3 to 10 days. But then again, we all could be on Trevor time for the next few weeks. Reporting live, I'm Chase Moffitt, Channel 6 News. Good to see he's doing well. Well, it's not what you'd expect to hear.